At twelve, I swore the oath, leaving home and family. At sixteen, I saw my master die. I took up her shield and her name, and on that day, I became a crusader. Armored by faith, driven by duty, bound to kill the enemies of Zakarum. Sworn to live as a crusader, and to die as one. Now, corruption returns to the hearts of men. I see it in the eyes of the mad. Hear it in the howling of the damned. A falling star in the west leads me to the town of New Tristram. The crusade calls me. And so I go. The falling star is close. There is death here too. I am a crusader of the Zakarum faith, and I saw a star falling on this town. It fell on the old cathedral. There was only one survivor, Leah. You should speak with her. Captain Rumford, more dead are coming. We can't open the gates until we drive them back. They keep coming! I've never seen anyone fight like that before. Guards, open the gates! You'll find Leah at the Slaughtered Calf Inn. Zakarum has fallen to this place. Don't you dare lift a finger to help our mayor fix it! Some heroes are fighting each other in an area near here. Wanna go? Oh, and uh, you didn't hear about it from me. <laughs> Afraid of damaging your armor or weapons? Uh, that won't happen over there. In fact, no one even dies. Disappointing, really. Are you Leah? They tell me you survived the Falling Star. I did, but it blasted my uncle Deckard Kane into the depths of the old cathedral. I tried to search for him, but the dead were already rising. I came back here to rally the militia, but the Watch out! The wounded are turning! Killing business. The dead will overwhelm us all, unless something is done. Something like putting them back to sleep? I can do that. Thank you. You should speak with Captain Rumford at the gate. He can tell you what to do. For many years, villagers were too afraid to settle near the ruins of the cursed town Tristram. But as time went by, adventurers arrived to loot the old cathedral, and their business was profitable enough that new Tristram sprang up to accommodate them. Fewer travelers visit now, though, and the town is mostly populated by craftsmen and farmers. I've come to help. How do we stop these risen dead? I admire your courage, but Captain Dalton and the militia were slaughtered by those things. Only I survived. Have faith, Captain. 
Have faith. Well, I have seen you fight. Strike at the wretched mothers and their queen. They're the ones vomiting out these horrors. They're attacking the barricades! There. That's one of the wretched mothers. There are more of them in the ruins down the road. Dead. That should slow the attacks. Old Tristram, Diablo himself was here.
Thank you for your help. But could you talk some sense into Leah? She won't give up on the idea of rescuing her uncle. She's brave. With help, she may yet save Kane. Leah, let us find your uncle. We'll need to open the cathedral first. The guards locked it up before they were ambushed. Rumford told me they fought their way back to Adria's hut. The key must still be there. Here, let me open the gate. Adria was my mother, but I don't know much about her. She died when I was very young. I was raised by Uncle Decker. And your father? I'm told he was a great warrior who was lost when Tristram fell to the demons. Look! A hidden cellar! Follow me! People said she was a witch, but I never believed it. Here's the key, and my mother's journal. What I've seen of it is disturbing. I want to know more about her, but that can wait. We need to save Uncle Deckard first. I will go. Stay here and learn what you can. Thank you. Aiden came to me last night. I suspected what was lurking within his troubled heart. I consoled him as best I could. Regardless, wherever he's headed, hell- For a long time, Uncle Deckard avoided coming back to this place. There were a lot of ghosts here for him. This is where Diablo drove old King Leoric mad and terrorized the people. I don't know what really happened here, but whatever it was, it was horrible. Nearly everyone who survived went mad. Leah, tell me about your mother. Well, details are hazy, but I know that Adria was obsessed with chasing the arcane. She knew she could never raise a child. Uncle Deckard believes that the madness and horror of her life finally caught up with her. I've never heard of the Crusaders. We're from the East and only recently came to these lands. Some of us did, at least. We serve the Zakarum faith. Well, I hope you're not planning to convert these people by the sword. I'm not here to convert anyone. My crusade is to cleanse the corruption that infests my faith. When that evil is destroyed, Zakarum will be restored, and people can choose to believe in it or not as they please. Kingdom of Hejistan, I heard rumors of Zakarum warriors called Crusaders. While the natives were most reticent, I was able to deduce that this order was founded 200 years ago, just as Rakis took his army of paladins west. But these Crusaders went east on a very different mission.
to test my skill. Kill me. I don't I don't want to change. Oh, minions, stay back! Back! May this ledge hold! The Skeleton King? The power of the Fallen Star awakened me! And soon, all will suffer as I have suffered! Gods, bring me his bones! Yet. Oh, thank you. But why did you risk yourself for me? Your niece asked me to find you, and I agreed. Oh, it is wonderful to hear that Leah is well. I feared the worst. 
I learned of this secret passage through old maps I found. I rescued the old scholar and learned from him that a creature called the Skeleton King stands between me and the star, but not for long. Leah told me of your crusade to find the source of corruption in the Zakarum faith. I may have information that will help you. Mephisto, Lord of Hatred, spent many years trapped under Travancall and slowly tainted the Zakarum in a bid for freedom. I have heard this, but knowing how it happened is not enough. I must find the source of the corruption to cleanse it. I fear that Mephisto is no more. His soul was destroyed on the Hellforge. I am sorry, Crusader. I've dedicated my life to this crusade, and your news does not change my oath. If I search my entire life and find nothing, it will still have been worth the journey. Uncle, you're alive! Thanks to you and your friend here. It was my duty to help. Now. I would know of the Falling Star. The prophecy of the End Days surely points to it as a sign that the End has begun. Please, Uncle, not more of your stories. All that matters now is that you're back. 